came in. This is about nine days ago, so hopefully it hasn't been too much. This should be my new uh, dinette bed. plush yeah not quite as firm as that other foam I had but nice it's nice and thick can't wait to try it out put it on the uh, put it on my dinette that should be pretty comfy to sleep on I'm glad it didn't get stuck like that <laughs> It was a nerve-wracking experience having to uh, cut up a $150 piece of foam, <laughs> but it's done anyway. Um, I could have ordered it for $100 more and had it cut. Maybe they would have been, uh, you know, the correct dimensions, maybe not. Um, it's good enough for a, uh, a box camper van anyway, and um, I'm glad I did it myself. First experience with uh, trying to get it straight. They're, they do make a uh, special uh, tool for, for cutting that, but I think that carving knife did a pretty good job. Of course, I can trim up like this piece right here. 
don't know why it did not come out totally straight because the I went with the metal as a guide instead of using my guide that I wrote in here I think the foam was still expanding after I opened it um, instructions say to uh, open the foam and let it sit for like 48 hours and of course I didn't do that but I think it'll be all right all right time to go try it out in the uh, camper van Plan on uh, making some cushions to uh, maybe fill in the corners here, right over here. I'll have to see how to do that. I don't know. Uh, corrugated plastic. I was hoping it was going to be rigid enough to uh, hold the contour of the ceiling, but I don't know if you can see it on camera. I'm going to have to go and probably uh, put some screws right in here to uh, help support it. So there probably would have been uh, could have been better materials, but uh, I'm going to I'm going with that now and. Uh, I can always carpet it or uh, put something else on it later if I if I need to. But for now, it's going to have screws in it. Not as not as nice looking as I'd like, but uh, that'll work. It's still early today. I got a lot of time to get stuff done, so hopefully, I'll make some headway.